Today we'll finish the new char characters from page 39 on the textbook. All right, the first one, Lao, which means old, as in Lao Shi, Lao Shi, E R S A N S I U L I O, six strokes, old. And don't forget this one to compare this word. We have learned, zhe means the person, so this is lao, old, share the same top. This is tu, by the way, then one stroke. And the bottom one, we have learned two, bi, bi, that means the dagger, right? All right, next one, shi, that means the teacher, a master, yi, er, san, Six strokes. Not really much we can explain or connect uh, this one to any other words since it's new. Lao shi, lao shi, not necessarily old teacher, just teacher. Because in the past, teachers were old. Guo, guo, that means country. Country, Zhong Guo, Mei Guo, Ying Guo, Fa Guo, Yi. R San Si Wu Liu Qi then finish. Um be reminded this is the word Wang King, my last name. Then you put one dot here, make it Jade Yu then you enclose it with a rectangle or square, like a national seal. So that's Guo. The country. Um, I know this here is for calligraphy purpose. There's a hook, but it doesn't really matter. Next one, e medicine, medical, as in yi sheng, yi sheng. So sheng, a person, xue sheng, person studies, xue sheng, student, yi sheng, person practice medical, a medical doctor. So yi er san si wu liu. And qi, seven strokes. Remember, the middle part is shi, means arrow, but here the meaning was borrowed to mean knowledge. Knowledge. A medical doctor used to be someone who's carrying a bag or a basket full of books and medicine, like herbal medicine, to walk around to see people. So, medical doctors carrying knowledge. Last one, shi. That means M, A's, R used in front of nouns. You can never say 我是忙, 我是好. So, 一, 二, 三, 四, 五, 六, 七, 八, 九. The top we have learned 日, some. And the bottom is written like this. Well, imagine it's more like a letter F. And plus, ren. Oh, sorry. Ren. So you got the bottom one. Then you put the top. You finish the top one. That's shit.